My name is Les Tryon. I'm the owner of Jizzy Jazz here at the Cotton Company, and I do what's called decorative painting. Uh, I paint about anything. The saying is, I paint on anything that doesn't stand uh, that doesn't stand still. And uh, one of the things I do are the glasses. I do them in bright colors, some floral, some dots. I also paint on another kind of glass, some glass balls. And these are unique because they're painted on the inside. In my studio, I have a whole table full of magic potions and powders. And I just pour them in and let them move and see what comes out. Uh, it takes a couple weeks to complete a ball because of all the different things that go in and the drying time that's involved. And put a little ribbon on them and they're ready to go. They're not Christmas balls, they're everyday balls. Another thing I paint on, traditionally decorative painting, is done on tin. And this is just a tin coffee pot made for the decorative painting industry. And it's painted all around. And it has a lid. Another type of tin is a little tin basket done in a very traditional style of painting, stroke work, which was the original uh, form of decoration on tin items. Another favorite item to paint on is wood. This is called a bent wood box. The wood is bent under steam and pressure until it takes the shape that the person wants and then it's put together and a lid is made and the box is decorated inside and out. I try to buy American and these wooden bowls are made by a wood shop in Wisconsin. I would go up and buy a trunk load of stuff and come back and it would take me a while to get them all painted but each piece is painted individually and distinctly. And you can see it's a beautiful piece of wood. Another interesting item are these tin canisters. And these are canisters that the Kodak company used for reels of film for movies. Uh, when they stopped doing that sort of um, uh, real production, they sold the tins that they had left. And so I was able to get several of the tins, which make great storage containers. This is one of the tall tin uh, canisters that uh, holds a, a different shape reel, I believe, but I'm really not certain about that. But it's done in a very contemporary, bright, colored design. Another surface that I paint on is paper mache, this little spring bunny painted all around, decorated with a little ribbon and some sponging and some floral. Clipboards, which are a useful item. You can use it to uh, clip your notes for your meeting or whatever. And this is done in a very brightly colored acrylic design of a rooster, strawberries, and flowers. Very traditional contemporary folk art design. Another item is a real sprinkling can. Paint it all around. Use it to water the flowers or not. Uh, that kind of covers the kinds of things I paint on. I enjoy the folk art style, the contemporary, the bright colors, the different surfaces. Going green with uh, items that I find, an old magazine uh, rack that uh, it's kind of scuffed up, I can give it a coat of paint and put new designs on it and it's new again. Bye.